Mommy, Daddy, you can't catch me. We're right behind you, little munchkin. This conversation isn't over, Jeff. Who was that other woman? Jeanette, I already told you. She's nothing to me. We're just working together. I don't believe that for a second. Mommy, Daddy. Are you kidding me? How many times must I explain it to you? Mommy, Daddy, I'm hungry. Huh? I knew it, I knew it. Yeah, and so what? You can't provide me anything as a wife nor a woman. How dare you? We have a child together. I tried to mend a relationship for Chloe's sake, but all you could do is continue. Questioning and questioning. If you just turned a blind eye, maybe things would have worked. Turn a blind eye? You're cheating on me, Jeff. There is no way I'm turning a blind eye. Then so be it. Have fun being a single mother. Mommy, where's Daddy going? Chloe, sweetie, your dad isn't going to come back. No, Daddy. <laughs> Ever since I was little, it was always just me and my mom. My dad left a picture when I was five. He's one of the reasons why I've developed so many trust issues. How could you expect me to believe in love when love destroyed my family even? If my dad was in the picture, it wouldn't have done much to help with my trust issues. My freshman year of high school, I had a boyfriend he cheated. Sophomore year, same thing, had a boyfriend cheated. I thought junior year would be better, but the same thing he cheated. It's as if all the men in my life were just full of bad news. Why should I keep on trying, right? Chloe? Chloe? Five more minutes. Chloe? Ah, I'm up, I'm up. You need to hurry, sweetie, or else you're going to be late for your first day of senior year. This looks presentable enough. There you are, my little sleepy head. Egg. This is what I get for staying up so late. Yes, sweetie, you need to get back into the school sleeping schedule. <laughs> I guess you're right. <laughs> it's already senior year, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm so, so proud of you, darling. Ah, oh, thanks, mom. My little girl is growing up so fast. Mom, I'm not a little girl anymore. You will always be my baby Chloe no matter what anyone says you are strong. I'm so sorry you grew up the way you did. I wish you had a better experience with a father figure. Mom, it's okay you tried your best. He was at fault besides you've done such an amazing job filling his place. Thank you for being the best mom in the entire world. Sweetie, no need to thank me. I'm your mom. It's my job to make sure my little girl is loved and taken care of at the end of the day. I want to see you smiling. <laughs> Mom. Oh, Chloe dear, save your tears for college right now. You need to make sure you're well fed for your first day so much on those pancakes. Scarf up those eggs and down it all with orange juice so you can get a move on. 
Aye, aye, Captain! Here we are, your very last first day of school. For high school at least and then you'll be in college. Are you nervous? Well, kind of, I'm mostly nervous about the workload. But besides that, I've been here for three whole years I can manage. Good. That's what Mama likes to hear. Now, go get him, Tiger. Bye, Mom. Have a good day at work today. Thank you, sweetie. Bye. Selena, hey? Chloe, hey. Uh, I really hope we get the same classes as last year. Last year totally sucked. We only had one clause together. I know, right? It was like torture. A no kidding, the universe doesn't want us to be together. It knows we are way too chaotic and powerful as a duo. <laughs> yeah, oh, let me see your schedule. Here, let me see yours too. Okay, okay, three classes together, that's not so bad. Way better than just one! Definitely and you. AP Calculus in BC. I don't know why you tortured yourself to go through calculus. For two years besides that it'll all APS. Long story. Short the colleges are gonna like what they see besides. I might as well take advantage of what's given less money spent on college classes. If I pass. Fair point. I highly respect you. And could never but it's not. Because I'm dumb it's more like it's a way too time consuming for me. I'm still a teenager and I want to have fun. I really wish I could be that carefree. How's your mom by the way? She's doing okay. She's still the strongest person. I know although she insists the strongest person in this entire world is me. You're both so strong I'm so proud of you both. Please. The more you talk like that the more you sound like my mom. We have 10 more minutes before the bell rings. I want to start heading to class. We have AP English Literature first. Sounds good. Let's go. Where should we sit? Up front! Oh man! You should know me by now, Selena! Ah oh, yeah, I know. I know you're such a scholar. <laughs> Can I sit here? Huh? Yeah, sure. Nothing's stopping you. Thanks. I like your eyes. Oh. Ah. Thanks. OMG. She's so good looking. Wow. She looks very suitable for you. On the first day. Go you, Chloe. Shush. She's right there, you know. Here you go get her, girl. We've just met. All right, class, let's get started. Yeah, but that's the first step into getting to know someone and then... Selena, you know, I still haven't found a guy I like. You know, I'm not lucky with love, so let's leave this aside for now. I don't think I'm ready. Come on, girl. Open your heart to receive new things. Ooh. You two in the front. Um, us. If something's so interesting. How about you share it with the class? No! We're sorry. Hum. As I was saying.
That was so embarrassing. But her laugh is really cute. I cannot believe our first period teacher is like that. Super strict. I, I cannot handle that so early. Usually I disagree and say that strict teachers are great. But today it was so embarrassing. At least that cute gal laughed at you. Is that supposed to make me feel better somehow? I guess. Oh, but her laugh was so cute. Yeah. Are you guys talking about me? Huh? Whoops, busted. We're so sorry. Huh, don't be. It's all cool. Still. Don't worry. I'm flattered. I was actually wondering if I could get your number. Oh. No can do. I'm not ready to have a new friend. Chloe doesn't, though. Hey. Don't tease her like that. Oh, that's cool. I was asking for Chloe's anyway. Ooh. Smooth. Um. So, Chloe, can I get your number? Come on, girl. Yeah, sure. Cool. Thanks, Chloe. I'll text you later, okay? Okay. E, girl. We have new friend again. That doesn't guarantee anything. Let's just see how it goes. So how was that movie date with Lona? It was so fun I couldn't stop laughing. When we shared popcorn together. You guys are such a cute couple. Selena, we are not a couple. Jez. I like boys. I'm not a lesbian. Yeah. You and Lona don't look normal. Lona treats me differently than you do. Egg. I guess. What? What do you mean? Did you like her? No. That's not it. It's just... I don't know. I don't know if it's because I lost so much faith in boys, in love. But... I don't know. I have a very strange feeling towards Lona. But... But... But me and Lona are a girl. That's disgusting to think about. I don't know if she's still interested. Oh, you don't need to worry about the fact that you two have known each other for two months now. I mean, constantly texting and talking anytime, so you feel like that. See what I mean? You can't be sure that's her. Check. Hey, Chloe. Look up. See, I told you. Now let's go talk to her. that her boyfriend they look so beautiful together hey chloe you look really cute today oh thank you you must be chloe oh uh hi and you are jack i'm lona's closest boyfriend from what he said you seem to be super amazing but i don't see much no offense excuse you jack watch what you say whatever you can do so much better I'm sorry. Did I do something? No, you didn't. Jack is just overprotective like that. <sighs> Jack, wait. I'm sorry, Chloe. I have to get going. Let's hang out after school, okay? Yeah, sure. Bye. Bye. What was that all about? That Jack boy is a such a... Save it. He's not worth your energy. You're a much stronger person than I am, Chloe. Personally, I would have not let that slide. If he really is her closest friend, then I want to get to know him. You're way too naive. Hey you! Jack! What are you doing here? Where's Lona? 
Don't bother thinking about that nor her. Listen, I'm not sure if you're caught up or if you're too dumb to catch it, but stop lesbian dating and love? Sounds really scary. Girls must love and marry boys. You know, the two girls brought no results. Stop that joke right now. I'm not comfortable anymore. Lona is mine. I'm the one who's always been by her side and her will marry me. Okay. What just back off of Lona will you? Listen, I'm sorry that you have the mindset that you do, but I'm not backing down on Lona. She hasn't popped me the question yet, and she sure as heck hasn't asked you yet. So as far as who she belongs to, it's no one. And I tell you again, Jack, you are a sick person to think that lesbianism is something very unusual and different. Lesbianism is not a disease and does not require treatment. The person who needs treatment is you. Jack, you need to heal your personality and direction. Oh my god. You are so annoying. Just stop trying to pursue her. That's enough, Jack. 